Bob, turn it off. Yeah. Yeah, we've seen all we need to. Is it true? Is it? I... How could you let me find out like that? Can we just go somewhere else and talk about this, please? Why? You've been sleeping with Belle. Do not pretend to care about my feelings now. Andrew, look. You could have told me. But you didn't, because you're a coward. Oh, that's why you wanted to sack to get her out of your orbit. Oh, my God! Andrea! Leave her. You and Belle. I didn't know what to say, OK? I didn't mean... Yeah. But you didn't. Sorry to interrupt. I still don't understand. When I gave the file, that was definitely Dormice and Vols, and it took me a long time. Paddy! What? I'll leave you to it. No, I get it. I was a stopgap while you were waiting for him. I knew there was someone else. I should have trusted my gut. Ellis. I asked you straight up and you lied to my face. That is why I broke up with you. I wanted to do the right thing. So you were sleeping with him while we were together? Right, enough now. Just leave the girl alone. No, she was cheating with Andrea's husband. Yeah, what happened to girl coach? I never meant to hurt her. Then why show her up in front of the whole pub? I didn't. I'm going to check on Andrea. Just admit it, Belle. Oh, love makes people do stupid things. <sighs> she can say that again. Hang on a minute. It's obvious who's behind all this. What? It's got your mother written all over it. She's not exactly buzzing buddies with Andrea, is she? And she'd never pass up the opportunity to humiliate a dingle. This has nothing to do with my mum. She's not even here. Look, it's none of your business, all right? All right, fine. Take it out of my pub, then. You heard her. I trusted you, Belle. Yeah, and I thought you respected me enough to believe me. Didn't we just tell you to back off? Oh, back off yourself. This is between me and Belle. Don't speak to her like that. Spineless lowlife. Having a go at her to hide behind your own shame. Vanessa, please, right, just let me talk to him. He's can we just talk privately? I need to speak to Andrew. Well, you're too late. She's gone out the back door. Never seen anyone look so mortified. <sighs> what a way for it to come out. No wonder he looks sick. Leave it now, babe. I don't want you getting stressed. It's not good for you. Hey, don't worry about me. Poor Belle looks crushed. Rishi. Do you think we should help him clear up? Yeah. yeah. Oh! I can manage on my own. Whoa. I guess I should get off. I'm having Elvira tomorrow. Nancy's having a kitchen done. She puts the fear up the builders. That's the dog, not Nancy. But at least she appreciates me. Carpe diem, Wendy. Not until you seize the day. Oh, I've tried. He must have read that letter by now. He's just letting me down gently. You don't know that. He might not even have seen the envelope yet. Could have slipped under the mat. Myriad scenarios. I suppose. <laughs> Stop being defeatist and ask him. 